Oh god, do you remember this guy? Captain Balto, there's a really, really powerful looking ship coming our way off the port side. It's it's the ship that everyone's talking about, the Delphinius, the one that the Blue Rogue Vice commands. <laughs> so wise, we meet again. This time I have a little something special for you. All right, men, on the pr on the pride of the Black Pirates, kill them all. Ah! Vise, Black Pirates did ahead. Hey, wait, isn't that Baltor ship? <sighs> Looks like they've done a little work on their own ship as well. Let's let's go test out their new defenses for them. Right, Baltor has like a new special move here that he can do, but one time I actually bet him before he even had the chance to use it. He is that easy. Oh god, I feel like I'm at the start of this friggin' let's play again. Bolvik time. I don't know if I'll manage to beat him before he does this new move, but we'll see. Ow, that hurt, really. See, he has like 15,000 health. In fact, yes, I'm pretty sure I killed him first turn one time. Because I used enough cannons and shit. I'm gonna kill him before he does this move, by the way, so don't worry. I'm afraid I can you won't be seeing it, guys. So dead. He's deader than dead. Yes, yes, Vega Cannon Plus. He is so dead. <laughs> You didn't even get to use your move. Haha. Uh -huh. And you gave us bugger all experience, like. Epic music. Don't know why the epic music comes on, because that wasn't really an epic fight. Curse you, Vice, how could you defeat me? Again! The next time we meet, I will defeat you. You will rue the day you crossed Baltor. <laughs> Good job, guys. Seriously, that fool doesn't know when to give up, but at least he's not a quitter. <laughs> not only do you have the Armada chasing you, guys, the Black Pirates are after you as well. You're quite popular. Haha, <laughs> this isn't the kind of popularity that I need. 
Well, I'm glad my last battle in Delphinius was a victorious one. Enrique! Haha, <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Alright, Sailor's Island should be coming up soon. Vise, let's go. Scene again. <sighs> Enrique, are you really going? I. I am the I am the Prince of Alua. I must return home to warn everyone of Galcian's plans. Gregorio was willing to give his life for what he believed in. I must do the same. You, all of you taught me so much about ships, about the sky, what it means to fight. And, and you taught me that there is all kinds of people in this world, people worth fighting for, people worth dying for. I want to protect them, all of them. I want to build a country where the people don't have to live in fear. Please forgive me for leaving your side, but I've got to save Valua. Right. Can't you think it over? Don't get airsick, okay? Right, I usually like saying, don't get airsick. Ah, fuck it. Don't get airsick, okay? You're a sailor now, Enrique, and sailors don't get airsick. <laughs> Thanks, Vise. It means a lot to me that you accept me as a fellow sailor by you. I can't promise that I won't get sick anymore, but I swear that I won't be embarrassed with Delphinis or the crew. Or her crew. Yeah. I'm not bothered about answering questions correctly or not anymore. Enrique, be careful. If you don't come back and visit us, I'm coming after you. Thank you, everyone. I'll never forget our travels together. Enrique has left your party. Oh well, off skate we go skate. Back to the Delphinius. Well then, shall we head back to Crescent Island and get Finn's ship ready? Enrique left us, and once we get back to Crescent Isle, Finn will be leaving us too. It, it kind of makes me not want to go home. <laughs> what am I thinking about? I'm sorry, Finn. I can't. I will miss you. This is the first time in my life that I haven't been excited about sailing somewhere. Oh. 